Konnichiwa, mina boku wa jeremi desu. Yoroshiku onegai shimasu. Today is Tuesday, November the 11th, 2014. It is day 315. And it's cold outside. Not so bad inside or I wouldn't be wearing this. Um, yeah. Today is the first actual cold-ish day, in my opinion, so far this year. We've been really lucky with that, I suppose, so I shouldn't complain. But, uh... Uh, it just means winter's another step closer. Uh, I hate the winter. <laughs> anyway, uh, I hope that you're all doing well. And uh, it was Remembrance Day today. Now, yesterday and today, there has been no school in Kamloops. Um, from what I understand, Williams Lake has a whole week off for whatever reason. Uh, Remembrance Week, I guess we'll say. So it could be busy at work tomorrow. It might not be. I don't know. I'm taking my brother's shift because he's not feeling very well. So... Hopefully he'll be all right, and hopefully I won't be. Th hopefully this cold that's trying to come on with me won't. <laughs> At least until after the semifinals, and if I make it into the finals, the finals have got talent or not. Actually, if they'll if it waits till the end of like if it waits till Friday, that would be fine because then I can probably let it run its course before the finals if I make it in. Yeah, all over the place. My mom's always like, you shouldn't say if, you should always say when. If this cold comes at me, when I make it into the finals, there you go. How does that sound? <laughs> I just, just kidding. <coughs> Excuse me. What was I going to talk about today? A couple things actually. One random thing. This is the like a fantastic flavor of Pringles. Pringles tortillas, nacho cheese. Just in case you're ever looking for a good chip and you haven't tried this yet, I highly recommend it. It's delicious. It's wonderful. It's right up there with my favorite flavor, which is pizza. But I really, really, really enjoy this. I tried them just the other day, and I I loved it. I finished this entire can in like 20 minutes yesterday. So bad, but what can I say? They're that good. Uh, actually, it it kind of ties in with that, I guess. Uh, I was watching some videos last night on YouTube, like many of us do, uh, about conspiracy theories concerning cartoons that we all watched as kids. Most of us. Uh, Ed, Ed and Eddie, how all of them are actually dead and they live in purgatory and there's no adults and stuff. How in Pokemon, Ash is actually in a coma and that's why there's Nurse Joy and Officer Jenny everywhere because there was one in his town and that's what he knows he's familiar with. That's why there's always some there. <coughs> Excuse me and why he can go from town to town to town, or region to region, and even though he's one in Kanto and Johto and all those others, nobody's ever heard of him, right? It's all like a brand new pallet town. Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! That was ridiculous. I totally wasn't even thinking about that till the moment of... <sighs> yes. Anyway, uh, what else? Uh, recess, same thing. The kids all died at different points. It's very similar to the Ed, Ed, and Eddie thing, except they're, instead of, their pur I guess their purgatory is the school playground. Um, uh, what's that one called? The dog. Uh, Courage, the cowardly dog. That's it. Uh, it's all from the dog's point of view, which makes a lot of sense, because it, it could be a perfectly normal environment, but to a dog, it's different, right? Anybody that comes to the door could be a monster or a stranger or something until you know who they are, so... That, that kind of works. I, I can see that one. Powerpuff Girls, it's all in their heads. They're just little girls that are imagining that they're superheroes. The mayor could be their grandpa playing along. The uh, gang green gang could be just the ne local teenage guys that have a soft spot for the girls and go along with their little thing. Mojo Jojo is their uh, older brother um, kind of thing that likes to wreak havoc on them. Uh, him is the creepy... Uh, uncle and uh, Dr. Euphonium or whatever his name is, uh, is is his brother and he tells them to stay away from him. <laughs> right? Like all these weird things. And uh, Spongebob Squarepants, all the main characters are the seven deadly sins. Uh, Winnie the Pooh, all of the characters represent um, uh, mental illnesses. Or, uh, or things like that. Depression is Eeyore. ADD is Tigger. Uh, OCD is uh, Rabbit. I don't know if illness is the best way to put it. I don't think so. Disorders, perhaps. is. I think that's how they called it on there. Um, really weird. It makes you really think about all that kind of stuff. It really took Caden by, by surprise, too, about the Ed, Ed, and Eddie, because that's one of his favorite series. He's like, what? What? <laughs> uh, 
Anyway, yeah, it makes you wonder. Uh, do you ever come up with conspiracy theories towards things like TV shows and stuff? Uh, my brother's a big conspiracy theorist on stuff. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. He won't admit it. Uh, it's it's weird. So I don't know. There's uh, there's that one that uh, my youngest brother st uh, seems to think that the Illuminati is involved in a lot of stuff. And then there's other people that think that there's reptile people. And uh, it's just, it's amazing all these random things that people come up with and stuff. But at the same time, nowadays it's hard to tell what's real and what isn't. I mean, back in the day there used to be some uh, genuine belief in, in things like ghosts and stuff. And now people could easily make things photoshop things in or video edit stuff in and it's just really sad because you don't really know anymore i don't think you could ever really know what's real and what's not on video you actually have to experience it for yourself but even if you have a real experience and you're trying to tell people about it what's the chances that they're actually going to believe you with everything else out there i think sometimes technology can be a little bit shitty in that respect but i don't know anyway i have to go and do my workout probably do a back one today because my back hurts it's been hurting lately and hopefully i can do a bunch of stretches and stuff with my wonderful machine to help alleviate some of that or it's going to make it worse but i'm banking on the fact that hopefully it'll make it better anyway have a wonderful day i will see you guys tomorrow which is wednesday i have to practice ah. <laughs> i don't know what i'm gonna do yet for got talent or not but we'll see i'm sure i'll pull something out of my ass for it i usually do and have a wonderful day Bye bye Jamatane mina.